Friday Night Football presented by the All-State Sugar Bowl. It's the Slide L Tigers and the St. Paul's Wolves at Hunter Stadium. Third play of the, after the half, Keenan Keem is going to run the option. He fools everybody. He takes uh, it all the way to the house. 61 yards for the touchdown. St. Paul then even to score at seven. So that's a big play by Brennan Kime right there. So St. Charles ties the game, or St. Paul's does at seven. Tigers with the ball, third and two. Jordan blocks it on the carry. It's a gain of 14 in the first down. Kime uh, again, coach. Later in the quarter, Kime again back to thro throw. He looks deep down the left side. He's going to hit Jabe Reina. Reina's going to. Take it in 67 yards inside the 20 yard line. Now oh, that's going to lead for a second and 13. Time again. Team rolling, rolling. He's going to look downfield. Emerson Cochran is going to take it in. 15 yard gain. First down. Next play. Keen this time is going to hand it off to Cody Corrales. Corrales turning his way all the way down to the one yard line. Two plays later, they're going to punch it in. Keen sneaks it. Wolves take the lead 14 to 7 on a really nice drive. Six minutes remaining in the game, third and six. Kime dumps it off to Corrales. He has tons of space. It's a 43 yard touchdown. St. Paul's now has a 21 to 7 lead. Three minutes to go. Tigers with a chance. Zayin Barty chunks one downfield, but it's going to get picked by Connor Lacoste. Lacoste is going to take it the other way. St. Halls is in full control with an awfully good interception by Lacoste. And then it's Corrales again. He's in for the touchdown from the five. Wolves extend their lead and they go on to win it. St. Charles or St. Paul's over Slidell 28 to 7.